To build the adventure trailer kit for your Polaris snowmobile, follow these steps. Attach the two torsion springs to the bottom of the support base using 12 screws. Torque to specification. Next, put the main base tube through the middle opening of the support base and move the base to the desired position on the main base tube. The support base will not be attached. Then, attach the tail light to the bumper slash tail light bracket using two screws and two nuts. Torque to specification. Next, install the bumper caps into the open ends of the bumper assembly. Then, install the electrical wiring support screw and nut. Next, put one vertical support base in line with the two holes at the rear of the main base tube. The torsion springs should be on the bottom. Then, put the bumper slash taillight assembly on top of the vertical support base and attach them both to the frame with two screws and two nuts. Torque to specification. Next, connect the trailer harness connector to the taillight. Then, attach the pintle to the hitch using a screw and a nut. Torque to specification. Next, connect the two-pin male connector to the taillight jumper harness. Then attach the hitch assembly to the main base tube using two screws and two nuts. Torque to specification. Next, attach the remaining vertical support base to the front of the main base tube using two screws and two nuts. Position the base accordingly to the size of your tub. Multiple positions are available. Torque to specification. Then install the vertical supports to the front and rear of the trailer using four screws and four nuts. Hand tighten the nuts so the mount is immobile. Next, put the arm on the ski stopper block and make sure the bushings are in line with the holes on the ski assembly. Repeat on the other ski. Then attach the arm to the ski assembly using a screw, two washers, and a nut. Torque to specification. Next, attach the ski assemblies to the torsion springs using a screw. Make sure notch in the trailer axle is positioned upright to allow screw to pass through. Torque to specification. Then attach the two red reflectors to the main support base and rear vertical mount. To install the otter tub, rest the tub on the vertical mounts and adjust the height as needed. Torque to specification. The center of the tub needs to match the center of the vertical mount. Next, attach the tub to the vertical mounts using two screws and two washers. Torque to specification. Then, center the support base on the bottom of the tub and attach using two screws and two nuts. Torque to specification. Position the base according to the size of the tub. For more information, see your authorized Polaris dealer or visit Polaris.com. <laughs>